without trying game. Um, so what made you come from the West Coast to come over? What, what made you oh, say, yeah. like, I want to come to the East Coast? Well... And were you homeless on the West Coast? Yeah, I walked all the way through. Okay. I lived outside, slept on So how long have you been homeless for? Uh, over eight years. Over eight years? Yeah, well, they blew up my island where I sleep usually, so... Wow. And I got sent to uh, Japan to go take care of... They were doing a super soldier program there, and they tore into our Mogao Goo, the, the reefs. Uh -huh. They're full of Mogao Goo that helps uh, filtrate the water. Yeah. And all that. It's the Goo of life. Okay. But Magua Life is for like our newborn fish and everything. Right. And so they did research on that and they went and found the land reefs and dug in them too and took out the Magoo trying to make special super powered people. It's like you're stealing, you're not going to make a super powered person, you're going to make a devil. Right. When exactly. you're putting that stuff together, you're going to make a devil. Yeah, exactly. Right. Like the Dark Elves from a long time ago. Okay. okay. Yeah, I seen a movie with that in it, but the Dark Elves actually existed a long time ago. They lived within the mountains. And they would come out and feast on people. The 21 days of darkness. Yeah. And it depends what you did in your life to what, if they came out after you or if they passed you, went to something else. Right. And that's what they were made from, is eating a coil reef of the land, of a mountain. And it turned them into, like, almost like a vampire, but not a vampire. Almost like a, a legend, basically. A troll slash oh, a vampire okay. mixed together. Gotcha, gotcha. Make you think almost like a dinosaur, but they're not. Right. And they'll come right on out to you and just grab you and take you off in the bush. Mm -hmm. And we've had them like a Blair Witch Project. Yeah. The movie. Yeah, well, yeah. there's actually it was a Blair Witch Project done. Right. Because that mountain range, that happened there. It was old coal mines, and these came out of the mountain and took campers and take them in and kill them. Mm -hmm. So then the lands became extremely haunted. So if you walked, you felt like somebody was pulling on you. Oh, wow. So, and I felt it around here sometimes walking around. Right. So, wow, that's crazy. Yeah. So what, what would you say rougher, like, far as the uh, Washington or being here, as far as being homeless? Like, do you, I know uh, it's a little colder up there, right? Here ain't too bad, man. I, man, I've been in Antarctica. I've yeah, been, so the uh, yeah, cold don't bother you, really. No, yeah. cold don't bother me, yeah. but, uh, like, I've been in New York. I went to New York before I came here. What, so. in the city, or? Yeah, I went all the way down in the city. Okay, yeah, that's... Yeah. I okay. down by the interstate and some guys uh, came up and handcuffed me and started beating on my legs and stuff. And I stood up and handcuffed them with their handcuffs. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right. Uh -huh. Illegal. Exactly, right. <laughs> I found in every yeah, state. some wild people out there. Well, I found in every state there's a group of people hunting us homeless people. Right. So I'm fitting in with the homeless people. Let's find out who you are. Right, right. And that's what you got to do. Have you been in, in D.C.? Uh, I went oh. through D.C. Okay. And I went to the other, uh, area next to D.C. And that's when... Uh, I ran into some things there that was crazy. The balloons that came through, yeah, they were dropping. Uh, when they deflated is when they dropped their drones. Oh, wow. And I call them drones, but they're combat bots. Okay. They got some human biological in them and not all human. Yeah. And so they can talk. Right. So, That's crazy. It is crazy. That's why the news is shut down. Yeah. Someone bought it out and shut it down so they're letting you see everything. Right. Like, there, there are places that had, uh, they use, uh, it was, I don't remember the name of the gas it was, but they were using it. It was almost like forcing, but not forcing. And the mixture, and it was uh, turned into vapor, basically vaporized. When it blew up, it just went woof in the air. Right. Turned into almost like fog, but it wasn't fog. It was pretty, almost like Agent Orange type stuff. Like people would like get a little breathe of it, and they turned a little psychotic, and then they dropped down. It was like, wow. I'm out of here. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, I know right that's there, one, of the, one, one of the, like, yeah. This ain't cool. So you, what, what you say was the worst thing you seen, man? As far as the, so far without right being now, too crazy, you know, you ain't gotta get in too detailed, uh, but it would be a person that would not stop attacking me after I got done beating it down. Found out that it was a person made out of elephant bone, ivory and stuff, like a clone they made. It had ivory uh, robotic joints in them, and uh, the skin of like your lion tiger mixed together to then grow the tissue of what they had on it from a genetic growth. Wow. And our doctors are turned out the wrong doctors are trying to act like God. Right. And make people. That's why certain people come up missing they take them and take them for genetics. Like I found out in Antarctica that's where they were stashing all the blood that they were taking and organs and any like 
sample they take from you from like colonoscopy and can or anything like that. They got that. like a big building. I think I seen something about yeah, that. Yeah, they had yeah. a runway yeah, and everything. Yeah, and it was in the side right. of the place, man. That's right. where Clark used to live. <laughs> that's crazy, yeah. That's what we always talked about. Like, that's Clark's house and you guys built a fort in Clark's house. I'm gone. Right. So, yeah. it's like the most dangerous thing I ever seen would have been the stuff that was coming out of the ice in Greenland. What, what's yeah, they that? looked like raptors, but they weren't raptors. They were like a mixture of a troll and a raptor put together. And it came out on the ice and would drag you into holes and eat you. So they had they had weapons too, or it was just no, they, they were just, just they just came out and grab you, grab yeah, you up like <laughs> like a trollish like dinosaur would come on out and grab you and yoke you. What? And I was like I'm out. <laughs> yeah, that's just that's it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy, man. But. That's, like I always mm -hmm. tell everybody, if you feel something pouring on you, just ignore it and keep moving forward and just say it's a good day. Do not. Right. Don't pay it no mind. Cause if, if you don't scream, they're looking for screams. They're looking for you to be like, ah, they're looking, trying to push you yeah, down. Yeah, okay. If you stay standing and just keep on going. Right. They train for the nervousness. Yes. Right. They're trying to find the people that they can scare, and that's what they feed on. Oh, wow. And that's why you got to show them no fear at all. And I, I say, I'm never scared. They keep picking on me, you're gonna make me lose my mind. Right. And then right. I'm gonna go postal. Right. Yeah, uh -huh. Nickname's insane, so. Okay, yeah. Got it down my right arm. Uh huh. Things you see sometimes will make you Everybody got a little bit out of them, but you know what I'm yes, saying? Yes, sir. Sure. And if you had a message for everybody, anybody out here, man, going through some stuff like you are, man. That's simple, always stay proud. And what I mean by proud is always stand for what you were taught as a child. Never, ever, ever bow to the enemy. Rise up for the saints and always stand together. Know all of us are soul brothers and sisters. No one's greater than anyone else to always stand together. Stand for a proper cause to liberate each other from tyranny and rise up to the light. Let your light within you shine or show the true strength of you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. You have a blessed one, man.